square, you know that how important it is to stand up for principles, to not back down and not to waver. And so what you're doing here and putting pressure on the Chinese government to push for freedom and liberty. I, I grew up in America where hard work gives you the promise of success. But that's not the case in China. Hard work, if you dare speak out, lands you in a prison. I know that many of you have family back home. And your family is a target because you believe in freedom and liberty. They are targets because you will no longer stand for a regime that threatens and hurts its own people. That in its quest for power, it will do anything and everything to prevail. So you are a beacon of hope, a light in a sea of darkness, and I thank you. The fight for liberty and freedom So I think about the founding of our great na nation, the United States of America, and how a few bold patriots had the courage to stand up against an empire. That a few bold patriots said, enough is enough and that we want to live in a free country. We are the beacon of hope, of freedom and liberty for the rest of the world. People come here, flock here day in and day out because they dream of a life in America. And with your efforts, more people can dream of a better life in China. So for someone who believes in and fights for freedom and liberty, just know that I will not be a quiet voice. I will not back down and I will not relent. And for you, for those that fight for freedom and liberty around the world. Your cause is my cause. And as long as you fight on the side of righteousness, righteousness and for the rights of the people, the rights of the many, you will always be judged by history of being on the right side.